Oh, and he's off. He's gone round. Oh, no, no. <laughs> this skippy needs to get away from traffic and back to safer ground. It's nice and fun chasing after a kangaroo in the rain. He's gone this way. Catching a kangaroo is as difficult as it looks. Them long legs, they put them to good use. A kangaroo can hop at speeds of 70 kilometres an hour, so Jimmy would need the stamina of an Olympic athlete to keep up. It's not a race, a kangaroo. You're fast, isn't you? Still too easy, Jimmy? <laughs> I give points to Jimmy for trying. I mean, it takes, you know, a, a pretty sporty person to attempt to keep up with a kangaroo. They say in boxing that you should chase a chicken to get fit and get good stamina. Try a kangaroo. Chasing him in about four circles. He's avoiding everywhere. No, 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 no. No, no, no. Wrong way. No. Good lad. There you go. I'm going to rugby tackle a kangaroo. I can't run faster than a kangaroo, so I have to use my human smarts and kind of like outflank it instead. But even then, it kind of outsmarted me a few times. Does this extend? Nope. I can give you a longer one. <laughs> Richie Gilbert, the snake catcher. He loves his job. He loves himself. You know, he had his hair gelled and his hair all pristine. And I was expecting a, a kind of a more rugged guy who...